about to watch summer game fest in it like 30 seconds and some fucking change i can't wait to see what trailers they drop in the day something happened with my voice i'm just so excited today 20 seconds yeah 18 seconds yeah 15 seconds yeah then we watch the shit and i'm getting lit shout out to the chat oh i cannot wait to play these games when they drop oh i cannot wait to play these yeah i'm back hey oh hey. oh my god now i see hey. why they now i see what they were talking about when they said you were loud as a bitch oh sorry up oh, this shit this shit starting shut, shut the fuck up i gotta lock in <laughs> oh, this shit loud this shit loud holy fuck this shit loud chat chat i'm gonna be positive this whole reaction watch i'm being positive yeah i ain't gonna lie my Please I'm welcome to too. the stage, the creator of the Game oh Awards, god. Jeff Keighley! Oh my god. Oh my god, it's Jeff Keighley! I ain't gonna lie, last- Yo, bro, last- oh my last god. time, my comments was not fucking with y'all, bro. Who? My YouTube comments. Hello, everybody! Welcome to Summer Game Fest! Jeff? No, y'all. Who's y'all? Everybody that was in the call last time. Hold on. We I gotta... are in person, and today we've got a do? look at what's <laughs> next in video games for you. We are live here in Los Angeles at YouTube Theater. And yes! it feels so good to be in person with a live fan audience for the first time yes. ever. Welcome, everybody. Nice. Hey, YouTube. It's me and JoJo. I know I said I wouldn't have nobody in here, but, I, you when know. When I started Summer Game Just Fest wait. back oh. in 2020 from a spare bedroom, I never imagined it would grow into this. Today, the video game industry has come together to show you what's next. This Under the is sea. a cross-industry showcase, meaning no matter where you play games, I hope you'll discover a new game to put on your wish list. The landscape Same. of video game events has certainly changed over the past few years, but one thing hasn't. There are a lot of great games in like development, and our singular like goal today right is to get what? you excited about what if the just started being like In just a few minutes, we'll see the I'm first sorry. extended <laughs> gameplay <laughs> of Mortal Kombat 1. Oh! No, Chad, we... It delivers, don't worry. Alan Wake 2, the reveal of Fortnite's next season. Oh, brother. And yes, we do have a very special grand finale that you're not God gonna want to miss. What is oh, it? I'll say it right war. now. But Final let's get Fantasy? Right to the games and gameplay. The no. first reveal is GTA? something you're not expecting, Ooh, which makes it imagine? that much more exciting. Here we go. First trailer. Triangle, circle, square. Oh, it's not this. What the fuck is this? Wait, hold on. Let it cook. Ubisoft. They cheering. They don't know what it is. Yo, chat. I missed this though. I missed tra re like has been kidnapped. seeing trailers and hearing audience in the background. Is it Prince of Persia? All hope rests with us. Wait, so is it Prince of Persia or am I racist? To it's rescue Victor. him and save the empire. We weren't prepared. For My chat is saying Prince of Persia. Either it's Prince of Persia or we're all fucking racist. Of course, some random nigga said uh, Wolverine. They weren't prepared for me. <laughs> if Wolverine. I had all that hype and it looked like this. I ain't gonna lie, I'd be kind of pissed. Ooh, chat, hold on. I ain't gonna lie. This is this look like something cool. This could be cool for the gaming channel. I'm not gonna lie, especially the games that we've been playing recently. Oh, bro, yo, Dante, bro, you know this light? It's like Hollow Knight kind of. It's like a, it's like a platformer. Yeah. yeah. Wait, is this song in the? Is this song in the trailer? I don't know. I thought that. Are y'all playing shit from the queue? Oh, okay, okay. In these times of darkness, hope is the only thing that keeps us fighting. Oh shit! I will fulfill my destiny and save the kingdom. Spider Verse. So Prince of Persia, the Lost Crown. I'm so fucking him when I guess games. I'm so good at this. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, the Lost Crown, January 18th, 2024. 
Wait. There's a little surprise. Prince oh, of Persia, The Lost Crown is coming in January 2024. A brand new action adventure platformer in the iconic series with deep combat, some huge boss fights, and of course, incredible platforming puzzles okay, and animation. One one, bringing one a one. modern one take one on the legendary franchise. You'll be able to see more at Ubisoft Forward Gay. on Monday as part of Summer Game Fest. All right, let's move along to another YouTube. iconic video joking, game relax. franchise that just celebrated 30 years. That's right. It's time for Mortal Kombat 1. Okay, here we go. I'm excited for this chat. I cannot wait to get in chat keep you and, and talk shit news. over the mic. Holy. It has been Snooze. four years since MK11, and ever since Ed Boon and the team at NetherRealm have been hard at work. I hope they still have that open mic shit. ambitious MK yet that reboots the series Snooze. into a new era timeline. And it's coming this September. I mean, sorry, I'm going to be positive. Everyone has been asking, what does it look like? Who's on the roster? How do the new cameo fighters work? Well, well now it is time for combat. No spoilers, but this video is literally insane. Here Play it! Here is an extended first look at the story, <laughs> gameplay, <laughs> and yes, of course, the fatalities. Oh, show us! Show us! Show oh, oh, chat. Oh, chat. Oh, chat. Fatalities? Here we go. I got it. I got a deafen. <laughs> it's gonna be fucking pissed at I have had okay. enough of you. Then go before I put you down. Fight. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? Oh my god! You have proven worthy of joining us. Come. There are other champions I must gather. What do you want? Sento. It's my family blade. Sento's mine. And I won't give it up without a fight. What? What? Whoa! Wait, wait. Yo, Ted, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> oh! Okay, let's go back to one here. Who are you again? That's, Lord Luke that's Kang, Johnny? Protector of Earthrealm. God of fire. What is that? What is that shit? What is that shit where niggas just become... Oh my God. Holy shit. Oh my God. The camera work in this shit. Raiden, but you're inexperienced. Whatever experience I lack, I make up for in heart. I like how the camera be zooming out and shit. You can get kind of high in it. What is that? Whose man is that? Blanca? Yo, wait, they... You can literally just start sneaking niggas. Oh! Oh shit! If the disease becomes known, you will be banished. Oh, it's the I mouth girl. Want what's best for you, or do you secretly covet my throne? Okay, for the braids. Oh my god! That's crazy. That that shit is crazy, bro. Oh my god. He zapped his dick. You can have fatalities duo. Oh. Finish him. Oh my god. Holy shit! 
Pizza. That shit was hard. That shit was fire. Holy shit. Holy shit. I mean, that was pretty good, right, guys? What the hard. fuck? I'm two sure for you two, have two many two. questions about what we just saw, and to tell you more, I am so honored to welcome Dante. to Summer Game Fest one of our huh? industry's greatest creators, a man who has been loyal to the same franchise mode. and fan right, base for more than three shit, decades. I don't know. Please join me in welcoming to Summer Game Fest the creator of Mortal Kombat. Oh Ed shit! Boone. Oh shit! Ed Boone. Congratulations! <laughs> They love you. All right. Well, Ed, uh, first of all, thank you for that incredible uh, world premiere. We got to see all the gameplay of MK1. And everyone just wants to know more about this. Because first of all, this is in a, it's, it's MK1, right? It went from 11 to 1. So tell us about this. Is it a new timeline? Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know how many people have seen the, the ending of Mortal Kombat 11. Liu Kang basically was kind of graduated into, like, you know, a fire guy. Yeah, I'm not going to laugh. I forgot about all of this. He created a brand new universe. And this universe, this is why we're calling it Mortal Kombat 1, is because this is the beginning of a new timeline. A number of these characters you've seen before, but they're told in a completely different story. And so... Sub-Zero and Scorpion are brothers now, and there's, there's all these things that were rivalries before are now allies. And I got to play through the story the for sure, bro. Up. So we're just kind of rebooting, and that's what the one is for. Well, it looks incredible. Everything we saw. I hope they have like a in-game gameplay. The like they explain like what it uh, just led to this. For four years on this. I'm so lost. The thing we got to talk about are these cameos because we saw some pretty amazing oh, stuff there. God, now, so tell us, how does that work? You obviously Yo, you have to sort of your main, you know, character that you'll pick, and then I know you also have a separate kind oh of cameo God. menu. So you pick sort of a pair when yeah. you start the game. Yeah, oh, normally in, in a fighting game, you'll you'll see a a roster oh, basically, you know, where you select your character. After you do that, there's a second roster of characters, which are a whole new, uh, completely different so fighters that are the cameo fighters. And these fighters actually, they will join the fight. But they, a lot but of they, blank squares there. Yeah, so it's kind of like imagine yourself with Sub Zero, but you have some of Jack's moves, and yeah. you can call him out. You can do it multiple wow. times as you saw in the game. Okay, gameplay, assist. You know? So you can piece, you, you can basically combine these two characters. All the characters can be combined with all the cameo fighters, and that's where you see. That's where the player's kind of imagination comes mm. in. They can actually customize it for what they like seeing, you know, the, the best team-ups. Well, so how does that work? So you're in gameplay, you have your main, you have your cameo. How do you, do you I summon them? Is time-based? Like, how often do they come in? To, like, it's not a tank. Someone said Homelander right? and yeah, Omni-Man. Exactly. Oh, and, my God. You're, you're basically summoning them. It's just one button pushes, basically summoning, but they have a variety. So you can go, you know, push that button with towards, and it'll do a, a I didn't even see the transition. Push I was looking down, at down, it'll do a different move. Okay. And so the combination... Oh, I see. So you can bring them in a combo. Almost. Exactly. Okay. You see how he walked and, off? And, so, and you see there's like a meter up on top, uh -huh. which is basic. That, that'll limit it. So you can't obviously fire them indefinitely. But um, you call you can call them pretty much whenever you want. And they have, you know, like in the middle of a combo, they'll have I'm excited for of, this. Um, you know, basically a whole arsenal of their moves. So Sony, you saw come Bro, out there. look at the Sometimes camera. Sometimes you'll see them appear twice in there. It's amazing. So time-based, they come out. And then obviously as you go through... You revealed some of them there, but are, it's a, is it a different set of characters that'll be in the cameos? Are there some repeats from the main roster? How will that work? Yeah, yeah. Some of the characters are going to be available as cameos as well as the main roster fighters. You can play Sub Zero with Sub Zero, right? <laughs> <laughs> you can play. Oh. You can, same thing with Scorpion. But a, a lot of our our cameo fighters are kind of. I feel like, like you got to mix it up. To our uh -huh. first game, so you'll notice. Sony Why would you want Kano two and the same characters? Kind of older costumes. And so there's there's a lot of that novelty. We have a lot of like really surprised ones. I think you you guys saw Goro. Yes, Goro was, was in, in there. there. Yeah, yes, yeah. Exactly. So yeah. so there's a lot of like kind this of really so digging into the old Mortal Kombat games as far as getting, you know, um, we really love the novelty of it. We really Ooh, want double the freeze. characters to feel, uh, you know, kind of nod to the old games. <laughs> well, speaking of uh, not of the old games, let's talk. See, it'd be you awkward when you do something like that and nobody heard what you said. Jean Claude Van Damme is actually now you got that awkward laugh. In this game as Johnny Cade, right? <laughs> yeah. Is that true? Yeah. <laughs> what are you saying? I don't was, yeah. People don't know the story. I mean, Bloodsport was such an inspiration for Mortal Kombat, so he oh, finally yeah. is now he's yeah, it, part it, of it. It's a huge first uh, full circle moment. You know, the the first Mortal Kombat game we originally wanted to be Van Damme the video game, and that, and that never really worked out. So I, I can't tell you how many times over the last 30 years we've tried to get him 
um, you know, we were this close yeah. like four or five times. And uh, so finally we got him and he's doing the voices too. Wow. So you're going to hear John Claude, his voice doing Johnny Cage lines and stuff like that. We're wow. really excited about it. That's wow. fucking well, cool. I know the team has been working so hard in Chicago to build this through COVID, and it's coming out in September, so we don't have to wait long, right? That's September? right. With this, this has been a very difficult uh, secret to keep yeah. <laughs> over the last over the last four years, and so uh, oh, we finally getting uh, games, man. We could not be more excited in terms of. Uh, but they can take their time because, bro, we got uh, so much. And we got so much other games to play. We're be showing a lot more content. I can't wait. A lot more characters. A lot more cameo characters. You know, so there's a lot of reveals that are coming up. Amazing. Well, Ed, thank you so much for giving us the first look at MK1. As you said, this weekend people will be playing it. Press See what about. We'll be seeing lots more coverage. Lots more Greek gods, though. That'd be tough as fuck. And cameos. That would be tough. Uh, Ed Boone, thank you so uh, much. Hey. First look at Mortal Kombat. Hey, buddy. Awesome. Yo, thank dude, you. I was doing nothing but saying positive shit about this game. Amazing. I'm actually so, so excited, excited for Mortal Kombat 1. It's going to be so late. Right. Bro, I immediately, I was like, I was like, I got it, Devin. For action RPG fans with the release of Diablo 4. Why, buddy? Leave it. Your comments would love what I had to say. Another big and anticipated Yes, bro. RPG is Path of Exile well, 2 from Grinding Gear Games, who have faithfully been updating and patching the original PoE since its release in 2013. We haven't seen anything on the sequel in over two years, but that changes right what now. Is Here about? is your first look at a raw gameplay capture uh, from Path of Exile 2, a sequel Path that of pushes Exile the engine two. and gameplay to a new level. Path of Exile 2, the game. Yo, another Path of Exile is great. Ooh, oh, oh shit. this is kind of pretty. Where are the gods? <laughs> hey, you! What's going on? What is this? Wait, whoa! <laughs> Diablo better? Yeah, we actually gonna be trying Diablo out. Wait, 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 when? Oh hell no! Nah. Whenever, uh, whenever they send me the, you know, the, the paperwork, uh, you feel okay. me? Uh, okay. Yeah. Wait, is 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 that multiplayer or something? What Diablo? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. And no, no, I wanted to try it out too. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh shit. Looks so amazing. I'll play with you if you want me to. Yeah, hell yeah. Last week marked the release hell of Street yeah. Fighter VI. Hey! Yeah, I just at Summer uh, Game Fest. Well, the team at Capcom modern has control. an important modern update control. to share with you right now. Oh, we got to update. Hold on, hold on. Lock in, lock it in. It just dropped. What could you even be updating right now? Lock in, lock in, lock in. Is it a nerf for Ken? Is that real? Why you guys like steal like bronze? Oh shit, Wait, he look kind of cool. This man, Hercules? It's Iron Man? Uh, Duken. Wait, he's got a gun? I am the advanced artificial intelligence Leviathan. Welcome to Pikitoa Island. Island? Battle Royale? Chat. Wait, wait, what wait, wait, the wait, fuck is have this? A gun? What? Wait, what, wait, <laughs> wait, what, what's happening? Wait, it's a battle royale. I no, swear to God, this is not. This cannot be. It's not a battle royale. It cannot be a battle royale. No, it would, it would make no sense. What is what? What I was don't that? Even know what we're talking, what, what's happening? Okay, no. What is, what, what is no, this? no. I see dinosaurs though. I love dinosaurs. I love dinosaurs too. I'm guessing Ryu from Street Fighter facing off against a dinosaur probably wasn't on your bingo card for today's show. That it Street wasn't. Fighter Cross Exo Primal collab will launch in the fall with the game coming out on July 14th. But guess okay. what, guys? That may actually not be the craziest collaboration on the show today. Oh. Check this out. Okay. They doing so good, bro. They're doing so good right now. They are. They are. They are. They are. They eating. They eating. They eating. They eating. They eating. Director. You can shape the fabric of reality, transforming everything you may think you know. Oh my gosh, it's Nicolas Cage. What the fuck? Voice. Oh, Dead by Daylight. Oh my, shut the fuck up. Uh, P-A-S-S exclamation mark. Is he a right. Yo, Nicolas Cage no way. Dead by Daylight oh in my July. God. I mean, I don't know how Get this on, but You might want to dab because I have some choice words to say right now. <laughs> okay. I figured the easiest Yo, way chat. to find out 
is probably to go right to the source. Hey, I was just about to say, is he gonna walk this out? Man's bold You're beautiful. What was this chat? What did he say? And a few memes. What did he say to Keanu? More than four decades You're amazing. Of incredible films. Oh, someone, Please, chat, so, someone's gonna try it. To oh my, breathtaking. That's what it is. Chat. Someone's gonna try it. Someone's gonna try it. Oh my God! Please don't do it. Just don't do it. Please don't do it. Don't do it. Please don't do it. Hey! Thank you, everybody. Thank you. <laughs> Happy to meet you. Nick, I gotta say, Please welcome don't do to the video game world. Oh, oh wow, yeah, thank you. I'm so happy to be invited to your very, very cool club. Everybody. You're very, very cool! Finally, I mean, I gotta say, this is such a, a crazy, unexpected collaboration. I gotta understand, how did this come about? I mean, some people be like, oh, maybe he'll show up in Fortnite. Maybe he'll be in a Hideo Kojima game. But Dead by Daylight, I mean, how does this happen? Well, it's, it's a museum of horror, right? Yes. And <laughs> When I make movies, one of my favorite genres is horror. And in, this, and, and in that genre, there's a character, a murderous ghost named Sadako, who I think is amazing. And she made an appearance in this game, so that was good enough for me. Okay. That's what, yeah, I mean, that's what's fun is you're playing one of the survivors in this game. How old is cool he? That, you know, it's, it really is this museum of Bro's horror. crazy. He still look good for, like, his age. Characters I know he up there. Together. Um, and you, do you, you play yourself, or who do you play? So I play this uh, heightened exaggerated version of a film actor named Nick Cage. <laughs> and he's, uh, he's going to a location thinking he's making a movie and instead he wakes up in the fog. And in the fog he's surrounded by crows and serial killers and it's rather amusing. And there's something about it that I think as a survivor is like a bonding experience. It's a bit like hide-and-go-seek. You have your three other teammates who are survivors with you, and you're, it's teamwork. You're working together to pull through, and I like yeah. that. And so that was a, a large reason for wanting to do it as well, that, that feeling of bonding with your friends. Mm. And you're fully in for this. I know we heard your voice in there, oh, so you yeah. recorded lines for it and everything? See, I want you to know when you're playing the Nick Cage survivor, I even have when you're choosing your skins, I even say, always remember to dress to match your talent. I want you to know that you're with me, that we're one. It's fire that he's like invested so though. So it's important to me that everything I do, everything I say, Some people from just, the screen it's to just the a paycheck. Grunt, down to the most minimal, exasperated expression of uh, a sigh, whatever it is, it's my voice so that we are fused. All right. <laughs> Fully method, Nick Cage. I love it. Uh, I, I mean, this is so fun. This game, as you said, is such an awesome kind of, you know, collaboration with so many different characters. For you, I mean, how did you find out about Dead by Daylight? Do you know much about the video game? Somebody world? very important in my family yeah. is a Dead by Daylight enthusiast. Okay. And, and that really put the uh, hook in. <laughs> Pun intended. Uh, <laughs> Uh, see, Dead by Daylight to me know, was an opportunity something. to branch out. To I've never been invited into this Please, space kid. before. Yeah. I'm always if, looking for new adventures. If Nicholas so Cage has as well, any can, can, gay relatives, that's who the Dead by Daylight is. Branch out and go on this Dead by Daylight adventure. This is why, bro. It took me nothing. This is why I have to keep him deaf, bro. I can't. Speaking about split seconds, what? Excuse me. What I noticed. Sinuses, allergies. What I noticed was that every move you make when you're doing this, when you're in the gaming space, <laughs> it's, it's timed down to the split second. It's, an, it's a very you know what I think of? experience when you're acting out. In every time I hear him talk. Every move, every grunt, every sigh you make has to be timed perfectly with the gamer's moves. Yep. So that was it reminds me of uh, the dude from something. the Men in Black. Well, we love it reminds me of the bad guy from Men in Black. Want to see Nick Cage in more games? Who Thank you. Where he's like... <laughs> All right, Nick, put your hands, so put your hands the in the air. air. Nicholas Cage, great to All see you, man. Put All your hands day, in the air. air. <laughs> sugar, sugar. Now, for all of you who want to play Nick Please. Cage in Dead by Daylight, the chapter officially comes out on July 25th <laughs> on PC and console. The Roach so Dude. PC players can try it earlier by downloading the player test build on July 5th. And here's an exclusive first oh, look shit. at okay. Nicholas Cage in Dead by Daylight. Wow. wow. See what JoJo thinks. This shit. Look at this dude, bro. Look. How did he miss? <laughs> Yo. What's up? This is so funny because like I undeafen at random times and it's just like. Damn right I made it. I was like, this is why I had to deafen. And then I undeafen and you were like. 
Yeah, Nicolas, Nicolas Cage had like a gay relative oh, that he would enjoy this. I was like, what the hey, fuck? Is goes here at Summer Games. <laughs> well, yeah, bro, because <laughs> because much, if Nick, if Nick has a gay relative, that's the damn idea. Wait, 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 wait. Elden Ring, Elden Ring, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Did he? Did he ask him? Oh my God, it's the forest. Just kidding, I'm just bullshitting. Sorry. Oh my god. What the fuck? Is this like a Doom clone? Damn, Damn they kind of lost me, man. I thought it was like third person. Yo, chat, like, you know what? This shit is terrible because no one even came out to talk about it. They just like played the trailer. It looks cool, but like, I know I wouldn't play it though. This is something you would play listening to like an album. It's too complex to be doing that. Which fire? Wait, really, Z Pro? What does Z Pro say? Did you know that Lies of uh, P demo is out? What's that? What's Lies of P? The, wait, wait, hold on. What's this? The um, the um, the Pinocchio thing. The one, the the one with the main character. That what? The, is it really? That's what he said. That's what he just said. Ooh. Chat, this is a VR game. So Fuck it chat. not play like this at all. Bro, chat, if I didn't have the fucking um, gamerhood shit, we would definitely check that out. But we'll, we'll, we'll do it tomorrow. We'll check it out. Actually, I might do it like just off stream and upload on the game chat. But we'll see. Chat. I'll, I'll probably save it for sure. What, 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 it, hey, Dante, it's a, it's a Lies of P. Lies of P. Okay, let me look that up real quick. Let me see. It's like the Pinoc Pinocchio game. Crossfire Sierra Squad. Take the fight to VR. Mm. Coming August 20th. Live the P like, demo. Oh, yeah, it's out, bro. Really the demo's out. Damn, bro. I gotta play that. Bro, this game was... I, that game was good. It was okay. I didn't like the ending, though. It was trash. Actually, I take it back. That just sucks. Callist... Call, what was it, chat? Callisto? No oh yeah, Callisto Protocol. Doggy. The yeah, Callisto Protocol. They they hyped, They got too hyped in they in their own IP. They're like, yeah, we're just gonna set this up for a second game. Fuck it. What the fuck? Oh, multiplayer? Is this four player? No turning back after this. You I don't sure? trust any vampire game after the fucking one that just came out. Oh no, I'm sick of this. What the fuck? Out piggity piggity pass. It's a lot going on though. Chat. I'm more into like, you know, the single player shit, you know? I just like to get lost in a story on my lonely. Like to get yeah, lost by my lonely. I don't really like how like so many uh, game companies are just like, okay, hey, we're gonna give you abilities and give you enemies to fight and loot, and that's it, and that's the game. Yeah, you know I mean, like every. Thank you. I thought it was just me. No, no, no. Every game company is like, yo, either we're gonna uh, we're gonna uh, do a Borderlands type game or a Destiny type game, or just a remix of both. Like that's really all it is, and it's just kind of boring. Why did I just get a Warframe drop? Yeah, I got one too. I got a drop. How do I get back to my chat? Why'd you click it? I don't know. All right, we have much <laughs> more Summer Game Fest to come, including a first look at the gameplay of Alan Wake 2, the world premiere of the new season of Fortnite, Call of Duty Season God. 4, and maybe a oh, few God. more surprises. Don't spoil it, bitch! As we go through today's reveals, use the hashtag gaming on TikTok on TikTok to react no. to the news. And we want to welcome everyone co-streaming the show yeah, live so on TikTok, God, Twitch, fuck. YouTube, and other platforms. Thank you, he's talking to me! On Twitch, we also have a special Warframe Twitch drop, a free Steinhack He's talking Warframe to me! Watch it, holy fuck! Of the show. Now, Thank speaking you. of surprises, Another legendary gaming hero is set to return later this year in a brand new game Mega built Man. from the ground up in a style that I think Mega is going Man, to get this fan base and longtime fans Mega of Man. video games very excited. Here's another Summer yeah, Game Man. Fest global game announcement. New thrills with a classic feel. Oh, shit. It's Mega Man, try watching. 
Fuck. Sonic. Ooh. Oh, that should look kind of cool. Oh no, that should look kind of cool. Chat, I never really played. I never played Sonic games. I was always, you know, Super Mario. Sonic is back in a brand new adventure. Lie. This is fire. Nah, this is hard. I used to love Sonic when I was little. Yeah, I never, I never got into it with an all-new look. Damn, this looks good though. It do. This should look fun. I'll definitely get this on my Steam Deck. Nah, this is cool. <laughs> nah, this is cool. Team, Team up friends. with friends. Oh shit. Oh bro. Oh, yeah, we on there, bro. shit. We on there. Four players. Oh yeah, we on there. Oh shit. Hold on, Mari. Oh, nice. Mari, Rico. Thanks. Squad. 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 Now that shit look fine. What? Bro, bro, you know what, bro? I have a hot take, bro. I wish more IPs did this with their games. Like, you know what I mean? Updated graphics with like classic type of game mechanic. Yeah. Does that make any sense? I agree. Like, I would love a Mario like this again, like a Mario Bro game where it's like just mad updated and shit. But too bad it's a Switch game, so it would never actually look good. Oh. <laughs> Ball 2023. Nah, that's five. Mm, okay. That's a few Standard for 2D classic Sonic that's bound to appeal to new and legacy fans alike. I'm new. This past April, Honkai Star Yo, Chad, they really made this because Frontiers was so ass. Bringing an exciting new character to space fantasy RPGs. However, we don't just oh, have God. a new peak for current players, but also for those awaiting the game's release on PlayStation. Take a look. What are we talking about? Ho uh, yo boy. I wish this universe some had space a few game. more things to do. Don't you get bored running across the map every day? Team Trailblaze, that's some duty. Mission one accomplished. Wait, is this an RPG? Yeah. Chat, I be playing games like this on my on my Steam Deck all the time. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Chat, I never play games like this ever in my life, so this is news for me. Never put season modes in the chat. Great. Let me get warmed up. Tournament starting? <laughs> Great. <Strike first. laughs> right. I'm gonna give it all I got. Need a hand? <laughs> Need a hand? What a pleasure. Let's see some sparks fly. <laughs> I think he got the point. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to not play this game, Chad. Holy fuck. My chat's all asleep. It, is they there a shot of sleep or they wait? No, they're asleep. Yeah, One person yeah, said, I'll handle this. <laughs> wait, huh? Oh! Wait, hold on, hold on. What the fuck is this? Why did I get off frame at the end? That's what I'm saying. Like, what the hell happened to the bitrate? This year on PlayStation. Right. All right. Inspired by the Boom. story of Pinocchio, Lies of oh. is a Soulsborne-like game from the team at NeoWiz, which is coming to Game Pass, PlayStation, and PC this year. Well, if you're wondering exactly when, we have news to share with okay. you on its release with this brand new trailer. I want to play it, chat. I want to play the demo. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wait, yo, bro, is it freezing for you? Is it freezing for you? No, it's perfect! It's perfect! Oh my god, it's beautiful! Hold on, Chad, I gotta reload it home. Chat, there's no way it looks like this. This is Cap, they're lying. Yo, I thought this was like an indie game. This is like a triple A game. I thought it was an indie game too. The fuck? Oh. Ooh, oh shit, this nigga think this is Street Fighter. <laughs> Yo, it, I'm getting like Bioshock vibes. No, bro, that's what it is. I was thinking the same shit. I couldn't place it though. Holy that shit. That fugly ass tree, what is that? 
Okay, some piano. Okay. Okay, a little. Yo, did like the bosses look creepy? Yeah. Nah, this is hard. This is hard. No, chat, chat, we're playing it today. We like, I have to play. I, I had to play it today. I'm sorry. I have to play it today. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. This is, bro. Wow. Bitch by an umbrella. Oh my god. Nah, bro. Uh, nah, bro. Damn. This is, this is Nice landing, but uh, let's not make it a habit. Nah, this is Oh, so shit. Hard. Look at the skins. Pre-order the digital deluxe. Play the demo now. Oh, oh, oh bro. God. I'm downloading it That's as we right, speak, by the way. Demo for Lies of P is now available across PlayStation, Xbox, and PC. Check it out. Chat, I can't. On Gamerhood is tonight. I got to get now off. Now it's time for the Chat. reveal of a visually stunning new game oh based on God, the classic that. Like Bongo, Josh, yeah, we'll story to do and created by one of the most celebrated anime artists of all time. This is one of those games that I feel lucky we get to reveal for the first time here at Summer Game Fest. I know. And I think you'll be pretty hyped once you see the gameplay Genshin all built Impact. in Real Engine 5. I know this isn't what I think it is. What is I it? know this isn't what I think it is. What do you think it is? Budokai? Ooh, it might be actually. No, I don't think it is. I don't. Oh! It is! Wait, what? It is! Oh, shit. Oh, you're right. Oh, shit. This is crazy. Wait, is it? Holy shit! What the fuck is this? They were like a different type game. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? Oh, shit. That was controlled? Chat, that was literally a ship from fucking, from fucking Dragon Ball. That was literally a ship from fucking Dragon Ball. Was it not? Okay, Sandland. Chat, this is pretty cool. I gotta play it. Fuck this game! Oh, he said fuck this game? Nah. Oh. That looked pretty cool. No, I'm mad now, man. I hope it's English dubs. I'm mad now, man. Sandland. See, someone else said in the, in the, in the, in the crowd. I thought it was Budokai. <laughs> uh, that's coming from Bandai Namco, and we're excited to see more of it soon. Independent games are such an important part of the industry, and one thing that's very important to us at Summer Game Fest is supporting those creators as well. After the live sh show, stay tuned for Day of the Dev from I Make Double ass, Fine boy. with some incredible <laughs> indie game reveals. Now, one of the biggest independent publishers is Annapurna Interactive, and later this month, as part of Summer Game Fest, they'll be revealing a number of ambitious new projects. Let's see how many you can figure out in this little tease. Okay. Uh, 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 stray, stray, go to game. Don't know what the fuck that is. Don't know what the fuck that is. Look not to imagine. Wait, this looks fire. Horror version of Stray, talk to me. Wait, this looks fire too. Wait, what'd you say? Imagine the Cappy Barber version of Stray. Why the fuck would it not just be like? Why would that be a thing? Okay, well, I'm sorry. Let's stray. Made it right, probably stupid. So. Stray was a cute little game, man. You didn't finish it, did you? Uh, no, I have, like, I'm like right at the end, though. Yeah, right at the end. <laughs> the game's yeah, fucking. Like, yeah, I'm like right at the end. Yeah, I'm like months I'm old. The very end of it, you know. Like that, yeah. Uh, at that one part, you was at that one time. I wonder what that was at the end. We'll find out later this month. All right. Next, we're stepping into the world of Throne and Liberty, a free-to-play PC and console MMORPG no way! from NCSoft and Amazon. I can hear the YouTube comments already. Always changing environment, right. massive scale so PvP after Dawn and the ability to it transform into creatures, bomb. to battle across land, you can sea, and air. Into Here's a look at Whoa. Throne and Liberty. Throne and Liberty. Give me the throne or give me a death. A guiding star has shattered. A 
its shards scattered across the world. Oh yeah, Chad, this looks pretty fucking promising, right? Is this a mobile game? No, bro, this is uh, this is uh, this is like New World type shit. Oh. You must find them. Okay, hair is laid. <laughs> and put down this threat. Chad, more Elden Ring clones dies of cringe. Let's know. Oh shit. Mm, no swimming. No swimming mechanics, I see. <laughs> the storm is coming. I mean, like, show me actual gameplay though. Like, this cussing looks fire, but what's the. Okay. Okay. Bro, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of For Honor when they had that, like, swaggy ass trailer. And, like, I don't know. It just kind of, like, wasn't really what it turned out to be. Like, mm. the trailer for For Honor was, like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say because I don't want to get people mad at me, so I'm just going to stop talking. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what's happening. So far, it's just look like... It seems like World of Warcraft. It, yeah, it seems like you just be running around just fighting things. It's like, is that it, though? I guess it's like an MMO, so like, ain't that how it's supposed to be? Fucking pets thing. <laughs> Gang beats with like animals. Yeah. Ain't this game been out? Party animals, that's what it's called. I remember we played that like a while ago. But it was like a demo or something. <clears throat> this shit still never came out? I think it was a demo. Zombie game. Pilgrims, yeah. summer is coming, and with it, a oh lot God, of cool stuff. Oh, God, dying boring. Get ready for darker, more dangerous nights and roaming negatives, horror nights negatives, complete news. with improved parkour rolling out with the next update in June. Then, right after that, we'll kick off an Yo, event season like you have who never still seen plays before. Dying Trust right, me, literally. for one of them, you will want to get your butt barbed wired. Dying Light like 2 soon, is fun. All right, buddy. You know, whatever, today. you know, whatever floats the boat. <laughs> All right, bro. What the fuck? My, bro, Did your shit just freeze? Lagging. My shit's freezing too. I don't think it's just okay, you. Okay, okay, as long as it's not me. Or not just me. Yeah, no, everybody in chat saying F. Okay, but it's them. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. Rumble. Crash Team Rumble. <laughs> Psychonauts okay, 2. Buddy. Samsung Gaming Hub. <laughs> Play over 3,000 games. We're able to do 2,000 games. No console required. Yeah, I gotta say it, man. Xbox Game Pass is pretty solid. Samsung Gaming Hub. Welcome back to Summer Game Fest. Isn't that great? By the way, Crash Team Rumble is going to feature playable Ripper Roo and oh Engine, oh. Neil Cortex's right hand guy in season one. Now it's time like his to suit. change the topic. There we go. Send into madness. Joining me is a guy who was come last on. on stage at the Game Awards 2021 to announce Alan Wake 2. He's come all the way from Finland. Please welcome from Remedy, Finland. Sam Lake. <laughs> I don't like his suit. His suit kind of sucks. Well, no, his suit is nice. This guy's suit's nice, but the, 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 the host's suit kind of blows. As always. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we are so excited because when you announced uh, Alan Wake at the game, or Alan Wake 2 at the Game Awards, you said 2023. We are in 2023. It's coming this October, and we are so know excited about Wake this, Sam. I know is. it's been a long time coming for fans and for you. 13 years since the first Alan Wake. Damn. So tell us a bit about what can we expect in the, the sequel. Fuck? It's been quite a journey. Yes. Damn, Chad, I was like, um, I was like, I was like 10. Alan Wake 2 is Remedy's first Yo, survival horror game. This, uh, mm. We have two playable characters. It's a 50-50 split between them. They are on their own separate terrifying journeys through two different worlds. 
and yet it's all connected. And the player I like his gets accent. to switch between them at given points in the in the story as they choose. Okay. Yeah, we saw obviously uh, at the PlayStation event you revealed uh, Saga, the the second character. Uh, tell us a bit about her. She's in Bright Falls, and she's sort of living a, a narrative that Alan has written. A bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. That's a good question to ask <laughs> okay, going okay. into this. <laughs> so yes, we, we have Alan Wake, our yeah. title character, of course, trying to escape from the nightmare dimension yes. of the dark place. Yes. And then we have Saga. Oh, it is a horror game. New hero, FBI agent. Uh, I mean, it's like a story-based horror game. I wouldn't really say it's scary. Of Bright Falls, together with her partner, yeah. Alex Casey. Okay. Uh, so how, and, uh, and there's somehow Who the fuck is Alex Casey? Way, right? Uh, they a are class. coming to investigate yes. a series of ritualistic no, I don't have murders. A okay. And and very quickly awkward. the investigation yeah, was... turns into a nightmare when they discover pages of a horror story. They may control. Uh, I like control. Control is by a certain <laughs> missing writer. I never played uh, control, but I heard it was good. It is. And cool. and this horror story starts to come true okay. uh, around them. Interesting. So obviously, it's you know, Alan is still going to be playable in the game. Hey, Dante. Experience his journey, mm -hmm. but uh, Saga, is it fucked is up that when they start talking too much, I just start thinking myself, really. can we get to the game? Split fifty-fifty. Do they have? I mean, they're setting it up. You know, because I think you yeah. can sometimes I just want to get like different too. sequences or orders. It's like moments like this. Right? I understand yeah, we, why Twitch chat is be like unpause the video. Like I get it. Saga. Okay. And and it's I get it. Well, but it's also a standalone experience. We are not expecting everybody to do homework okay. if, if they have not played the original game. Yeah. Uh, this can be enjoyed uh, as is. Saga doesn't know anything about the lore, about the supernatural uh, in this world. She will be going in very quickly. She has to learn to survive. So Chad, what system was the, what console was the first Alan Wake uh, on? Be on? On that journey with, with her. Xbox, I think. And, and uh, mm. then we open up the experience so that you can hop to play Alan Wake in oh, the PS3 dark place, okay. uh, as he's trying to find his way out, and you can keep on playing as Saga in the Pacific Northwest as the investigation oh, it's remastered goes on. on the PS5? And you are free to switch between Shoot. them. Ah. There are a lot of connection points yes. uh, in many surprising ways, but there is no right way to play through this and then at the end one of the characters die yeah he's as, just telling us everything Alan, all the way <laughs> close to the end or a saga or you can keep hopping between these two dude uh, chill man it. well you're always so good at kind of telling challenging interesting narratives in unique ways i mean remedy's always been known for that and you especially so we can't wait to see how these stories intertwine i'm sure throughout the experience today though I know you brought with you some some gameplay of Saga. There we go. That's what I want to see. A, a raw segment of the game, right? Yeah, raw gameplay for the first time. Don't explain ever. it. This is early on from the experience. <laughs> They're hyped, uh, Sam. They're ready for. He's it. gonna tell us. He's about to tell us. So tell us what what are we gonna see? What, oh uh, my God! Why do supernatural forces of darkness have uh, darkness. brought the murder victim uh, in this case? Back to life as a monster. Yo, this and, dude has made and, me tired. Uh, I'm literally Saga tired is now. Outside Pride Falls at Cauldron Lake, trying to find him and stop him. Oh my God. Okay, with that, let's take a look Thank at you. raw, unedited okay. gameplay let's from Alan go. Wake 2. Thanks, Sam. I jinxed it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Well, oh, the black, the girl, the, the black girl. Okay, the graphics look fucking. I remember crazy. seeing the trailer. No, chat. We got to get on this. We got to play this. Oh, wait, hold on. Nope, kind of creepy. Never mind. Yeah, no, I don't like that. I don't like that music. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh my god, this looks so good. Yeah, oh see, god, bro. Somebody's oh somebody's god, that scared me, that scared me, that scared me. See, that's that shit I'd be talking about, bro. I watched this. Insidious last night and I literally couldn't sleep. Where's your fucking backup? It's giving Resident Evil. That's what I was gonna say too, but I want people to be like, shut up, Jojo. <laughs> shut the fuck up and let the game talk, man. Like, oh my god. I got this ice box where my heart used. Yep, it's in there. Is this a zombie game? 
Uh, no, I don't. I don't think so. I think it's literally like you fight darkness, like fight shadow people. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, oh, that nigga darted no. out of there. Fuck no. I like the vibe though. I do like the vibe. Whoa! Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, he's like, ooh, like, like, he's like oozing darkness. Why would you aim? Why are you aiming the center mass? Shoot that nigga in the head. Shoot his legs. Wait, can you see his insides? Oh my God, you can! Look at his leg. A monster, like Nightingale. Can we get subtitles? The general store. Uh, what the fuck? I mean, I like that it's something different, though. You know, it's not just another fucking zombie game. Where that shotgun off the wall? That's what I'm saying, you bullshit. <laughs> Text on the heart is clearer now. Legible. Oh my god, don't give Lil Uzi any ideas, please. Tattooed heart. Like I he said, don't need no tattoo. See, heart, she done got into a cutscene, she didn't even pick up the shotgun. Nails done though. Alan Wake 2. What the Wait, that's the look they gave us? This case okay. with me, Anderson. Okay, sis. Killer left the Oh, her partner message. died. Her partner died, because where where it's the fuck have you been? We were all trapped in a horror story. The horror story wanted us dead. There's something. Chat, is that the guy on stage? Something in the no. Oh. Something oh my mind. god, what the fuck was that? October, of course. Fuck, October is the worst month ever. A long hey. time coming, but Alan Wake 2 looks incredible. Looks Thank good. you, Sam and Remedy, for that cool. first look at gameplay. Now yeah, let's get a I'll first look at the co op campaign of Warhammer Space Marine 2 from Saber and Focus. Warhammer. Mm, okay. We're facing a Terranid splinter fleet. Splinter they engaged fleet. us on two planets. You'll this shit does look kind of cool, I'm not gonna lie. You'll be grimacing the men of your fight on what the world is. I have my reservations about your main statement. <laughs> there could be questions. Will that be a problem? No. Gears of War? Not a Warhammer, bro. So, Gears of War. Whoa! <laughs> This shit looks so far, chat. I cannot wait to play this. Chat, what came first? What came first? Warhammer or Gears of War? Because it's giving. It's a, ton a, a Warhammer, I think, actually. Wait, so didn't Warhammer come first? Officer Yo, this looks so crazy. It's literally giving Gears of War, though. I, I like it, though. I love it. Come yeah, no, Warhammer came first. Well, my chest, so. Warhammer came first? Okay, respect. Respect. Yeah, it always looked like, like this, this play style? No, no, no. It was uh, like it wasn't this graphically updated when it first came out in the 90s, though. Open the gates. Open the gates. Care to see who can slay more Xenos for the Chiron? I thought a piece of that statue would offer more sport. This should look fire, bro. Yeah, this is crazy. This should look crazy as fuck. It's giving World War Z. Space Marine. <laughs> it started as a tabletop game, the fuck? What is this, bro? Kung Fu Pants? Never mind. What the fuck is this animation? I like games that look like this, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, oh, this looks fine. Nah, this looks hard. Uh, this looks hard as fuck. Raven, I present. What the fuck? Wait, they did all that? It's just like a, it's just like a choice game. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I play this. <laughs> I will. I would unironically play this. I'm still trying to like understand. 
I think it's like you rule a kingdom and then if you fail your kingdom, it. Yeah. So yeah, is it like yeah, choices yeah. or is it like you actually play the game? Like that? Uh, it's uh, it's yeah, like some chill might, shit. I think it's a mixture of both, if I had to guess. I'm pretty sure there was a game like this that came out a while ago. Yes, your grace, Snowfall. Now it is time for another global game announcement, and this one comes from the minds okay. of Saber Interactive Wolverine. Focus Entertainment. Ah, never mind. And yes, horror master John Carpenter. It's a brand oh, what new the world. Fuck? Wait a minute. A this is a game? Story, and looks like a heck of a lot of fun. Check this out. It's Silent Hill. Just kidding, I don't know. It might be, I don't fucking know. It's, uh, know it it's, uh, what's, what's the name? John Carpenter, bro. Like, what the fuck? I don't, know, I don't know who that is. Wait, that's that actor. A ain't that chat? We gotta be ready. I'm trying to think what he was in. What I just saw him in. Nobody half asses it this time. Ruby. Oh, I didn't watch that show. I seen him from some random movie with Jennifer Lopez that just came out. But I'm pretty sure that, that's what I'm talking about, though. On my mark. This is a. Oregon? Mother, mother. He was a mother. That's what Three, I. That's what I remember him from. Two, no oh shit! John Carpenter's Carpenter's toxic command. Okay, so it's just like a Left 4 Dead shit. It's a fire trailer. It is. It's hard. I'm probably fast on this though. Hey, bro, for an app, I'll play this for show. Yeah, ad sponsor. Yeah, for show. But I just see myself playing like probably one, like one level, and then like never picking it up again. Yeah. Yeah, there's far too many oh, games like this. Man, like, far too I many. Really, I really wish more games focused on like story. Yeah, like a good, like a good two to four player story mode. That's yeah. like my dream game, bro. Like a 12 hour, four player more story mode. Collaboration. John Carpenter and uh, Saber with Toxic Commando. That looks uh, tons of fun. You guys think any of those zombies made it? All right. Well, this song is <laughs> Good one, man. long awaited full 1.0 <laughs> release of Baldur's Gate 3. And today, Baldur's a new Gate. member is joining the cast. We're about yeah, to see forget, the reveal what this game of was, Lord Ember Bortash, the commander of a mechanical army of Steel Watchers. He's a second antagonist and is voiced by a familiar name. Nolan North. Chat, I got a pee. Let me know what I missed, okay? I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Right. Larian Studios. All right. Enver Gortash. Swearest thou by Baldurin's blade to defend the citizens of Baldur's Gate by like Baldur's from enemies Gate. within and without Baldur? Ain't that nigga get fucked you up by Kratos? But you talking about Baldur's Gate granting me complete power over them. A new age is upon us. Gods have mercy on those who would stand in our way. A mad dog understands the yank of the leash from the hand of its master. But it cannot be an equal. Okay. You can be my equal. I mean, shout out to him. Wisdom. A brittle alliance can never be mended. I ain't gonna lie. This look kind of. Only break. This look kind of. I want to lead this city to glory. I ain't gonna lie. Scorch its earth. Friends, allies, to my side. Love the actor. Let us usher in a new dawn. But I'm a pass this on it. This city is mine. I'm not ready to call you enemy. What do you say? Shall we be allies? <laughs> Harry Potter. <laughs> the boy who lived. Fame is a fickle friend, doesn't it? <laughs> it, said it was piggity, 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 pass. It isn't you I answer to. Gortash. And who are you again? Fake ass woo. Shut up. Shut your ass up. Baldur's Gate 3 is on track, Sven tells me still for the end. That was like a woo, I guess. Check that out. All right. This fall, Marvel what I miss, what I miss, what I miss. Insomniac are set to bring Spider-Man oh! 2 oh, exclusively oh, to PlayStation 5. Oh, Sounds oh, like you guys are a little hyped. So to oh, tell us more is Brian Intahar, game director at oh, Insomniac. Oh, Brian, thanks for coming Shout by. Shout out Insomniac. I know you guys oh, are deep into that. That nigga ran on stage. Looks like we have some... Uh, <laughs> 
fancy art behind us. This is, is this the box? This is the box art. This okay. Is, you know, this is fire. This is clean. This is all you need. This is something good. It has two on the box for a reason because yeah. this game features two spider men So we're really excited about it. Right. Absolutely. Uh, Peter and Miles, uh, we're so excited about this um, you know, experience Miles. that you guys are doing with these sort of two characters. Uh, we saw some great gameplay at the PlayStation Showcase, but I want to talk about the two villains i think in the game that were, there may be more there are more but, uh, there are more out there <laughs> thank, you for, ones, thank you for thank you for we have fine. some new art to show of uh we obviously craven we got the reveal at the, uh, yep. the playstation event so tell us a bit about oh uh, him and how he so craven's it. very different from any character we've done he's not you know he's not powered by magic or you know tech he's just the best hunter in the world and he's coming to new york for his Facts. various hunts. Oh my and what's God. better than all oh my God. the oh, that marvel characters that live Holy in new york city oh, so oh, peter miles and others, he's oh, on the hunt. And others, dot, dot, dot. Yes, uh, yes. But uh, Venom also, obviously, uh, you know, Symbiote is a part of this whole story, as we saw in the game. Play. Oh, uh, my oh, God. Oh, Holy God. shit. Good oh, reaction to the art. God. Uh, I'm, I'm glad you're happy. Oh, I don't know how much you're going to tell us about Venom. Is this, uh, it, can you tell, is this is an Osborne Venom? Can you tell us, what's the origin of uh, Eddie Brock? Don't Venom, tell or? us anything. It is not Eddie Brock. Okay. It is not, oh, it is shit. not Eddie Brock. Okay. Um, our goal was to tell an original story, something yes. you haven't seen in the comics or the movies yet. Obviously, I love, that. love Venom for a reason. Yeah. I love All those that. those things you love about the character are going to be there, but how the story plays out, who is Venom, you have to play the game to see how it goes. Really? Out. Yeah. Beds! Wow. Beds! Okay. Beautiful. That's, that's been a tease. <laughs> now, yep. obviously, the, the, the symbiote is a big part of the gameplay, and, and one of the things I think we were all struck with the footage that you showed that is at not the lame. PlayStation Showcase I'll tell you why. is uh, you know, how that Hold is going to really impact the gameplay when you're playing as you know, Peter. So tell us a bit about that and how you know, the gameplay is going to be dramatically different. Yeah, I mean, I think you saw it in just the, the raw power, the strength, mm -hmm. and even the transformation of uh, Peter's moves in that in that in that gameplay reveal. Yeah. You know, he's you know we call him the acrobatic improviser, him and Miles, but you can tell there's a lot more strength, oh a lot gosh. more raw power, aggression, which you saw both in the moves and how Peter talks. So yeah. it's not just what happens in gameplay; it's what happens how the story plays out. Interesting. Oh so that affects him as well. So yeah. good. I mean, you story. saw some of that in. Yeah. There's much more. Look what he does to this dude on the wall, chat. And I know the the journey is also more expansive. You've got Queen. Are you that far ahead of me? More of sort of. Yeah, I mean, no, 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 much doubled in size. Oh, okay, so okay, it's, okay. it's Manhattan, Queens, Brooklyn, and then the being able to use the web wings to traverse at yeah. speeds. It's about to come up right now. Oh my god. Before, yep, yep, yep. Um, is Bro, really awesome. what did they cut it off? Hugely yeah. ambitious yeah. game you guys have been oh God, building oh uh, the past few years. Oh God, we saw at the, uh, so at the PlayStation event, so so uh, it said at the end, fall 2023. And I think, yep. you know, we're like getting close to that. Are you guys feeling oh God, confident Chad, comes out that you're going to make it this fall? You know, Jeff, I know you like exclusives. Yes. <laughs> and I can promise you we are very confident what we're going to tell you right now. Oh. Wait, yeah. what? Okay. Wait, what? Yeah. Let's take a look. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's a release date. <laughs> Let's go! October 20th. Let's Spider Man go! 2 exclusively for PlayStation oh 5. Oh my god. Awesome. Well, Brian, thanks oh so much for stopping by. I know you got a lot of work to do. Wrapping up oh the game, God. and we'll check it out in October. Thanks, Brian. Yo, damn! Oh we got God. our date. All right. Now what was that other game coming out? Alan World, Wake. I ain't World gonna lie. Survival Alan, go to sleep for a little bit more, bro. Friend and collect mysterious creatures called Pal, I gotta play, who can dude. also fight. In other words, kind of like Pokemon yeah. with guns. <laughs> and then, bro. Then we're gonna look Just at the know? Land of the Morning Light, a new expansion to Black Desert Online, which recreates the mythical Wait, folk tales yeah. from Korea's Joseon Dynasty and some huge bosses that too. The last trailer to Spider-Man, what did I say? I said they were gonna make an original, you know what I'm saying, like story, and he just said that Spider-Man dies. Peter Parker dies in this. If in this, that's in this what movie, you, you know, my, this is what I think though. This is why I like. This is why I like that they're doing a, a whole like original thing, like. Venom is not who people think is gonna be. It changes it because you're not gonna go in just knowing shit or expecting shit. Right. Like, bro, why do people wanna play a game where they already know or watch a movie where they already know everything? No, I agree. Like, sometimes it's okay to change shit up drastically if it if it like makes for a better film or game. Yes. No, I agree. And someone said that that would make it have no replay value. It would have a lot of replay value. Please stop. 
please stop. Please stop. But, look, look, but I'm just thinking like, you gotta think about it. You, you gotta think about it, okay? Game okay. mechanic okay, wise, wait. development okay. wise, it would make no sense. Like, and especially in New Game Plus, or not New Game Plus, but um, 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 like after game going for 100%, it would take, it would just ruin it. It would ruin it. Like people would no. like choose to not beat the game and All just- I'm saying is, is I disagree. Plus, okay, if it, so so again, they said that uh, it's not like you can be any Spider-Man at any given time. That mechanic is a story mechanic. So like, so like you can't just choose what Spider-Man you're gonna be, which means that it might leave you with one Spider-Man at the end. That's what I'm saying. That's, that's my theory because it's not like GTA where you're gonna switch to Miles or Peter or whoever at any time. It's a story mechanic. They said that. And that for those who are saying that, they said that you can choose, and they said it's a story mechanic. My chat, they literally said that. My chat is saying you can. They're all saying you can. Well, they're fucking wrong. They literally said it's a story mechanic. <laughs> it's a story one. It's for the story. I'm just saying, chat. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, look, look, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. That's that's one thing, right? Our and I'll say it when the game drops. But if I'm right, y'all better not speak to me ever fucking again. I swear to God. I think it's I think it's like we told it story ourselves. like when it's going in the story like as we were playing in the story if you're fighting those people as Peter Parker you can't just you probably just can't randomly switch at that time during the story you right now it's a story mechanic which means that some so, so like for example right three wrong uh, uh, some missions are gonna be for Peter right and then for Miles so it's gonna switch you there that's what I'm saying right but again so we don't know how it works yet. Obviously, the game's not out, but I have to imagine that you can't just switch in between either or at any time you want. It's a story thing. I think you can. Which like when you're doing like the side shit. I, like I think you like like, like like let's say this. Let's that, let's say this. You finish. Has their own missions, but I, but it's not just you can just play. Uh, I think so too. I think so or. too. I think like you switch. Like let's say you finish a mission and that mission you had to play it as Peter Parker. You finish that mission, then you want to switch to Miles. And then you're doing stuff around his miles. You go to the next mission, and the mission says, uh, like, only Peter can, like, start this mission. And then yeah. that's when you have to switch. But, like, you can still play no, 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 both no. people. It would switch it for you, though. Like, you can't just switch. Like, if it's a uh, Peter mission, it would just switch it for you. Again, I, I, to my knowledge, as far as I know, which, again, I could be wrong here, it's not just, like, GTA-type switching. You Like, it, it's, it's going to be switched for you. It's a story mechanic. That's what... That's what that's to my knowledge, and again, if I'm wrong on release, then y'all can bitch me, that's fine. But if I'm right, oh, oh my God, oh my God. All right, here we go. All right, now we're gonna look at an exciting new mobile game from a legendary oh, never mind. Uh, franchise. You were saying, JoJo? <laughs> what? Oh, the mobile game? Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, fuck, I, I forgot it's mobile. It's gonna be fucking stupid, I don't care. Again, chat, for those who are getting legit mad at me for my theory, oh my god, I don't care. Please shut up. It's not that deep. We're getting a Spider-Man game. Oh my god, just be happy. <laughs> <laughs> like, what are we doing? I just think that Spider-Man's gonna die. That's just my. That's just. That's, that's what I think. I just think that would just be crazy. Like, I, I just don't see why they would do that at all. It'd be so far. It'd be so far. Like to develop upgrades, like bro, I'd be so pissed if I couldn't play like continue in 100% the rest of the game. That's like, um, oh my god, that would piss me off, bro. Like I upgrade fucking Miles or Peter to the max, and I get all this cool shit, and then and then it's just like useless. And I hate games. I hate games that when you beat it, you can continue to 100% it, but it's before the like finale. Like I yeah. hate shit like that. I hate that you have to go back, like you have to play before the actual last level. Yeah. That shit's so annoying to me. I feel like it's cheap. It's like a dream sequence. Yo, are you gonna play uh, Life of P on stream or off stream? I'm gonna play uh, the, de I'm, I'm probably gonna play the demo. Um, you should make it a video if you play it off stream. Oh no, I'm for sure making a video, but um, I just don't know like if I'm, registration how I'm going to do it. Fantasy VII yeah. Ever yeah. Crisis has just yeah, no, started, I turned it down because it's a mobile game. Who gets a fuck? We were having conversations. Upcoming closed beta test. Now, speaking okay. of Final Fantasy... Okay, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. No, 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 no. Spit on my face. Today, oh, during Summer Game Fest, DoorDash has sorry, your sorry, back. Sorry. Get, 
Yo, he's trolling. It's coming. It's coming. It's gonna come. It's gonna come. He's trolling. Oh my God. Plus, get the chance to win a Final Fantasy 16 prize pack. He's smiling like he got something in his back pocket. We got you. You. All right. You cannot. Here's a look at the game we did. Fuck you. Last year at PGA. Banishers, Ghosts of New Eden, the story wait, of two ghost hunters wait, wait, in the it was wilds of North America. Yeah, he's tro he's trolling. It's coming. It's coming, bro. It's coming. Oh my God. Like Captain Price. Life to the living. Say. The rules of the game have changed to the dead. Brother Six, going dark. We are banishers. We end suffering for those who live. We bring closure to those who But like what's what what game is this now? Um I want us back red. What the fuck? I want revenge on what killed me. I mean, it looked pretty cool. To I'm not gonna lie, it's giving for spoken, bro. It's giving for spoken. Huh? Oh, it's, for it's giving for yeah, it's, it's giving for spoken. Like it looks yeah. cool, but it looks like it's about to be a whole lot of nothing, I ain't gonna lie. I banish you. Death to the death. Yeah. To be together again. Oh shit. Or do we part forever? Come out, whatever you are. Come on, show yourself. Red. Every bloody time. I mean, Banishers. this is cool. Ghost this is cool. of New Eden. I don't know, bro. I feel like it's going to be like just dry. Yeah. So they did. What's this? Oh, shit. Wait, is, wait, is this, wait, is this Yakuza? I ain't never playing Yakuza. Bro, I think Yakuza is a game you really fucking like, bro. Especially uh, Age of the Dragon or the Dragon one, whatever. That one's fine. Oh, shit. <laughs> Okay, dripped out. <laughs> right? The fur on. Trouble has set. Car is still there. Nah, this is this is gonna be fun. Nah, 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 Damn. What? What the fuck? I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna play some Yakuza games soon, bro. <laughs> my god oh my god that was so hard come on his dick the man who erased his name no that's hard as fuck that's hard as fuck mm. good morning someone in chat goes uh, uh, it is 7 32 a.m okay. i hope you have a productive day underwater game sucks stand. yeah i would not be playing this especially Adjusting the scary game wake up Good morning. Just stand. Based it's giving the press subnautica. Big but big but big but boring. Like we're good. Oh my God, the little wee. Definitely a leak here, Tim. Oh yeah, I'm not playing I'm this. I never in my life. Y'all will never see me on this game. <laughs> Fuck no. This shit would scare the shit out of me. How long has it been now? Three years. Oh hell no. Two months and seventeen days. No. What sort of no. operation are they running down here? Fuck. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. He shouldn't be here. Mm -hmm. Someone there? Mm -hmm. This doesn't make sense. Someone else does. Dude, if something big pops out, I might scream. No, 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 no. Hey. Are you there? I will, I will pass. <laughs> no. It's a beautiful new game, Under the Waves, and today, incidentally, is World Ocean Day. Fun fact. Yeah. All right, next, oh Call of Duty. 
Well, there's a new Call of Duty coming this fall along with Warzone Mobile. Today, we're going to give you the first ever look at Season hey. 4 of Modern Warfare 2 Warzone launching next week. Here's your first God. look at Bondal, a new Warzone location with points of interest, including a medieval castle, a soccer stadium, and an abandoned zoo. Yep, it's all happening. Check it out. Here you go. Chat, when's the last time I played COD? Like, seriously. Uh, last time you played it. Yeah. Because, like, I don't play this shit by myself, you know what I'm saying? Like, I gotta have friends that play. And, chat, why, why is War... That's what the fuck? Batman? Was that Nick Merck? Yeah, I think it was. Chat, like, why is Warzone still, like, still a, still a thing? Wait, there's free order bonus suits? Oh. Damn. Damn. I fire for them, though. Whether you like the game or not, you gotta respect it. That's a fire shot. Mm. Nah, hard as fuck. Season four hard as next fuck. week. Today is a big day for video games, but also a huge day for Porsche. The iconic German automaker turned 75 fuck? years old today. And to celebrate their contributions Wait. in the automotive and gaming space, what about the boys? All raced a 911 in some point Wait, the in boys. the game. Xbox has teamed up with Porsche for a limited edition run of 75 consoles inspired by six famous Porsche race cars. And I'm thrilled to debut the first design here today Wait, inspired that by only the Porsche 963 consoles? that's racing this weekend at the 100th running of the 24 what? Hours of Le Mans. Let's take a look. I said the boys in the car trailer? What? Interesting. I wonder why. You see how I missed my mouth chat? What the fuck happened? Oh my! Mm -hmm. Ew! I mean, this looks shitty. <laughs> like, that shit looks ass. And here it is. Break it! The Porsche Xbox Series X. These custom consoles that are not for sale. But you can enter for a chance to win one right the now. The kind of cool. PorscheXboxSweepstakes.com. Make sure to stay tuned for the Porsche and Xbox social channels for additional opportunities stupid. to get your hands on these special Oh, is it because consoles. it's like Pride Month? Right. Next, Phoenix uh -oh. Labs are building the next great homophobic. entry into the cozy farm oh sim God. genre. Like a cozy game Wait, let it inspired cook. by classics like Animal Crossing and Stardew Valley. Previously announced for Nintendo Switch, there's now some exciting news for PC players too. Let's take a look at Fay Farm. Dear friend, life Oh my god, I know Chris Chris is losing her mind. <laughs> Alright, bro, I chat. Days chat I'm gonna put so up Chris's quickly. stream right now and I bet she's like the hype as fuck. Hold on. Before I know it, they turn into seasons. Uh -oh. It's been a breath of fresh air. I think we found a way to get cozy and settle in. <laughs> never mind, never mind, never mind. There's something more I've been itching to explore. <laughs> this is Chris's type of game, though. Realms where magic comes to meet us. As long as we're prepared, we can face anything. <laughs> we can face anything. <laughs> so, what do you say? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean you can see me playing this? I like what? I bear, I don't play anything ever. I just hate on it and then play it whenever when it's like I'm like yeah you know, the mix. We promise variety. There it is. Faith Farm and Mortal Kombat. He's like, the same he's he like, loves you shit on the game. He loves you shit on the game. No, nah, he really did. He really just did. He said, we told you we fucking suck. Enthusiast at second dinner, the developers behind the popular collectible card game, Marvel Snap. What's up, Ben? Oh, my God, man. Man, you guys have been on fire. Last Yo, Don, time I saw you, you was at the Game Awards today? when you won uh, Best Mobile oh, Game. Uh, seems like you've been very busy. We're excited about the Spider-Verse content you've been doing. Lots know. going on over there, right? Yeah. 
Yeah, it's been uh, it's been exciting. We've been doing a bunch of new features. Some of the damn, calm down, fucking Greg Hip, and uh, <clears throat> some new game modes. Yeah. Yeah, new game. Is that is that a, a segue, game. Ben? Certainly, yeah. yeah. I'm excited damn, to announce bro, Marvel Snap's biggest update ever. Uh, we have a new game mode coming Yo. next week. It's is anybody else hot mode. in here? Because I'm hot. Holy! A super competitive experience uh, and some exciting new rewards. But you don't have to wait till next week. If you haven't tried Marvel Snap, go download it right now on your mobile device or early access on Steam. All right, Ben. I, I love the enthusiasm, Ben. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> made for YouTube. Yeah, right. well, we heard you brought uh, something there. fun uh, with you for us to watch, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. I appreciate so, him for listen, pointing out like things that I we know. I am incredible at card games. Yeah, not for real. I often win. I promise you, I'll uh, But some people, <laughs> and maybe you've had this experience, Jeff, uh, some people lose. Yeah. Right. Damn. And I like to think it's because they suck. No offense, Jeff. Yeah. Awesome. But sometimes, yes. sometimes it's because they might just be a little bit unlucky. Cue the tape. <laughs> <laughs> that was awkward. That was bad. Oh, snap. That was bad. That was bad. Okay, mm. I don't have a hey! hand of cards here, but that's. Fine. I love this dude. See what I draw in future turns. Anyway, Who is that? Reveal the first bro, he's location. a he's a fire ass voice actor, bro. Just one. Each player oh, for real? destroys yeah. their deck. Okay, I guess I will work with what I have. I'll Someone said Gangi. Medusa on location number two. She gets plus that's two right, power. Right. And let's see the next location. Clover Dangerfield has a 25% chance of destroying your cow. Okay, well, I mean, 25% isn't that bad. And it's gone. Okay, well, I have some powerful cards in my hand, so I can just wait. Let's see the next location. The Big Bar. Players cannot play four, five, or six costs. Dad, let him get his bag. Let him get his bag. You gotta be kidding me. Also, if you don't play a card this turn, you have zero friends. Now you're just being W at man. W at he, he deserved that. I don't care what else I say. <laughs> Still to come, we're gonna look at Immortals of Avium from EA Originals and Ascendant, and the world premiere first look at Chapter Four, Season Three of Fortnite Wilds. Oh my god! Now, if you're looking for the smartest way to level up your gaming this summer, compare top credit cards side by side with Nerd Wallet and start maximizing your cash back rewards on everything from Wi-Fi to headsets. Now, here's a look at King Arthur Legends Rise, a new cross-platform UE5 game for mobile and PC, a Fantasy Squad RPG adventure that is available to pre-register today. King Arthur. <clears throat> Did you just snore? No. What the fuck was that? Everything it wasn't me. To save your kind. Is he trolling? I swear to God, I heard a snore at the start of it. <laughs> I swear I heard like a snore at the start, bro. Nah, bro. Wasn't me, bro. <laughs> fucking boring ass fucking. Oh my God, bro. Dude, this is so fucking boring! Bro, what fucking system is this on? Fucking Switch? App Store. Yeah, I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> In GTA, sorry, Sean. <laughs> Wayfinders. Like, holy Do fuck! You remember the what fall? is this shit? It's like Clash of Clans, bro! <laughs> So, you know what I want to see more of? I want to see some to more of that uh, that one game where you fight and can go to different like timelines. You fell. Y'all know what I'm talking about? And the world was yeah, bro, Spider Verse. We get it. <laughs> oh my God, no! <laughs> He's like, yo, guys, I would really love a game where you can like go in and out of dimension, uh, 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 dimensions and like see the multiverse. It's like, yeah. oh my God, bro. Yeah, bro, we know. <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> <laughs> you funny as fuck, bro. It's so funny, bro. <laughs> like, bro, cause, bro, cause you be doing it without even knowing you doing it, bro. No, it's an actual game where you fight, and then you'll be like a Viking, and then you can switch Kovic. it. You have like a gun and shit. Hey, chat, Kovic. Co oh, this is what like you could do the new maps and shit. 
Yeah. Bro, fucking yeah. Yeah, we know, bro. <laughs> Okay, so Darth just, Vader? Uh, the trailer? <laughs> Steve, seriously, you don't stand a chance. <laughs> Project under construction. Oh, this is a whole different game. Yeah, that was just Fortnite. I was like, what the fuck? What did you say, guys? One more game? Good morning, scavenger. What is Scavenge happening? Surroundings to retrieve and recycle anything that could be of value to scavenge. Why all these games look the same? Right. It's like they're transitioning to like different. What the hell? We didn't promise you variety. I just love how none of Captain's these games are even being like set started. up at all. Four three one five. I like it. Just cram it all in, bro. Star Our Trek. Fleet is cautiously entering hostile territory. Star Trek is trying to be like uh, Jedi. Bad. Chat, Star Wars is better than Star Trek. Change my mind. Oh, wait, you fucking can't. Don't even try. <laughs> You're knocked out, buddy. Oh, wow. Yo, <laughs> Dante, I have your chat like open, like over here. Mm -hmm. I'm here again. That's another me. Bro, if they would have kept that art style, it would have been so swaggy. I don't know why. I begin again. Yeah, I thought it was going to be so that art style, too. To so, yeah, this is a roguelite. That's You're all it is. It, it's, it's like Hades. Oh, yeah. Damn, this could have actually been cool. You're not this, the only one. This is like Hades to me. I will become Legion and crush these demons. The Spangle. Onwards. I can feel the more. Uh -uh. Very cool independent game. All right, next up is a brand new IP from Ascendant Studios, a single player first person magic shooter called Immortals of Avium. It's fast oh, and fluid. It's an FPS in a fantasy setting, kind of like Doom with magic. It also has a great ca cast led by Darren Barnett as the main character, Jack, and he joins us now. Hey, Darren. Hey, guys. Great to have you with How us. You doing? Thank you. This Thank is you. such a, a cool game, super high production value, spectacular Bro. gameplay. Uh, tell us about the guy you play. You're the main character, Jack, right? Yes, I am playing the main character, Jack, as seen behind me. He's yes. a oh battle God. mage that controls okay. all three forms of magic, <laughs> triple threat. I'm uh, not going to lie. Like he's funny, but he gets the job done. Well, Why he uh, looks like the, the gameplay as we've seen is just so fast-paced, so much action in it. Uh, you know, with all the spells, the spell casting, and the magic. Um, what can you tell us about the story and sort of how this battle mage Jack uh, <laughs> he, he sort of becomes a battle mage, right? Yeah, he kind of comes from nothing. He's a, uh, I guess they call him a street rat, is what he was. Um, but Rip he uh, yeah, during a uh, time rat. of intense and trauma, they call him a hood rat or power to control <laughs> magic, don't uh, becomes part of the Immortals, which is like the elite Navy SEAL squad of this world called Avium, and they are in the middle Marvel? of an ever war, fighting for the control of magic. Okay, uh, I, you have a great cast. You, Gina Torres, in it. Lots of amazing actors in this incredible, really high production value game uh, that's coming out this summer. Yeah, who's Paxton? We don't have to wait long for it. Um, and I know you brought something. Wait, is that, with you it, to share is today, he Paxton? Which is a gameplay sequence. Which Someone said how he looked forty and sixteen sort of at the same the game, time. Right? Yeah. Um, so this is <laughs> yeah, a wild part of the young. game. This trailer. I'm getting lost in his eye. He does have nice eyes. Immortals and myself. Yeah, no, he do have nice eyes. Confronting Sandrak directly, who is the top villain of this game. I like his build. In the Ever War. Uh, I'm not like looking at his dick or anything, Chad. I just, just noticed his shining belt. It was like a gay thing. It was like a normal foot neck guy in the middle of the ocean as it moves uh, around. Uh, um, it's wild, so let's take a look. Uh, all right, right, let's take a look at yeah. some brand Excuse. new <laughs> gameplay from Immortals of Avium, which comes out this summer for PC, PS5, and Xbox. Thanks, Darren. Thank you. Okay. Sandrax literally pushed us to the Okay, I mean, look good. Everyone that can fight already is. And we're still losing. Oh, we seen this Overwatch. earlier, didn't we? 
the fuck? fuck? That's a big bitch. Welcome aboard, immortal. What's our bearing, sir? North by northeast? Five Hang knots. On. We'll catch him, sir. This shit looks ass. This looks like it's gonna be super boring. I'm not gonna lie. This looks like... I don't even know, bro. This looks shitty, bro. I have nothing good to say about this right now, so I'm not gonna say anything. Action, action, Is that coming to life? Okay, gameplay. Get to the control room and protect Selco. Oh, this looks Sendari ugly. I will hold up the down here. Got it. Bro, it's an EA game. Like, this looks like every EA game ever created. Chad, every EA game looks really good, plays like shit. Every one of them. Bro, they can't even like just show something. They have to skip so much shit. I know, like they can't even show a full like. Segment. Yeah, that tells that tells me that it's just a whole bunch of enemies, and you just gotta go through a whole bunch of rooms and fight them to get yep. to the next. Bro, I'm telling you, bro, it's literally every EA game. They yeah. like it, it, like again, like it looks good, look kind of cool, but then you play it, it's, it's, it, it played clunky, it plays shitty. Yeah. The dialogue's in weird places, like it gets lazy towards the end. Like that's that's every EA game, literally. Summed up. Someone said this is like a commentary video that would be playing in the background. <laughs> Not real shit, bro. Not <laughs> real shit. Like, it's definitely something to just look at. Yeah. Brainless. I don't. I just don't get the appeal of games like this. I want to be an immortal. I want to fight this war as one of you. You're what's called a triarch. The Pentasad has gifted you with the ability to manifest all three colors. Dante, they magic. said it was like Doom with magic. They did say that. That's kind of fucked up for this them to say that. Nothing like Doom with magic, though. Like, I seen a Doom. I seen a Doom trailer. Animations. This, this is time. not. This, I seen a Doom trailer. This is not giving Doom. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like. This is like Doom without all the cool things that make Doom Doom. <laughs> Love that we get to show you guys so much amazing raw gameplay today, and that game looks incredible. Coming out this summer from Ascended. Don't lie. Yeah, now, one I say, game that got constantly out of there, reinvents itself is Fortnite. Hey, Chad, free this guy. He's going on me. Oh my God! Wait, Fortnite. Hold on. Launches and today, Summer Game Fest is debuting the cinematic trailer to preview the season. The center of the island has collapsed, revealing a vast hidden jungle with ancient secrets to discover. Oh my god, I know course, Rico's losing his mind. new battle pass lineup <laughs> where you can unleash the power. Yes. Rico and Mario. Cyber Rico and Mario, somewhere just, just headbanging right now. Like, let's go, let's go, let's go. Chat, they're going to bring in Optimus Prime because it's like, you know what I mean? They're going to bring out Optimus Prime, Prime and Dom. Yeah, they're going to bring in Optimus Prime, Bumblebee, Dom, all that shit. Nope, you know, you know what it is? They're gonna bring in the fucking Little Mermaid. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> That'd be so crazy. Hold on, I know it's not dinosaurs. I ain't gonna lie, they might have just won me. Bro, of course it's dinosaurs, bro. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, they might have just won me over, man. Yeah. You, know, Dante, bro, you know what I wish, bro? I wish that they really bring back that one dinosaur roleplay game we all did. Temple Run? Oh, yeah, bro. That shit was fun. Do you remember when we, when you, me, Ricky, and Crack were all crocodiles? Yes. And, and like, and like we had a mom, and she really did the, like, like took care of and us. And it was some and random person. It was like some random person, too. Oh, my God, bro. We had a mom and dad chat. They literally said, come to mama. I'm over here. And we really just did. That shit was fire. Wait, God, wait, it's actually, remember. it's actually fucking Optimus Prime. What did I fucking say? It's actually what Optimus fucking Prime. What did I fucking say? I just told you. Oh I my God. <laughs> I fucking told Yo, you. Yo, this is not real, bro. 
This is just not real anymore. I told y'all, bro. I fucking told y'all. It's just not real anymore. Autobots roll out. How? Because the next Transformers is done. Okay, so Queen. Of course we're going to bring in fucking... <laughs> Look at Optimus. I'm done. I'm done. I'm so fucking... <laughs> this is ridiculous. Jojo's dying. Wild launches tomorrow. Well, finally, guys, it's time to get to our grand finale. Oh, shit. And it is a deep honor for me to present this game. Oh, shit. What you're about to see is a world premiere trailer that gives us a new look at an expansive world we can't wait to explore again. Final Fantasy. This game comes from a studio that surprised the world and redefined the RPG back, genre with its iconic characters and rich storytelling. Sh shut up. And I want to thank them for this trailer for GTA. one of gaming's most anticipated upcoming GTA. releases. Little GTA. We're true. Wait, 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 what? We're still here at the scene of this terrible. Ah! Yes! Yes! Which swept through sectors 0, 1, and 2. Amidst the wreckage of the expressway, search and rescue what? operations are already Whoa! In Whoa! Oh shit! Oh my god. Wow. Just look at it all. Is this our so green? Is these our characters? After everything we've done to it. It is. It's still going strong. Okay, these are our characters. They look that way. But in reality, it's barely hanging on. I was wondering, what's Cloud been doing these past five years? Where's he been? And you're asking me this? This is gonna sound crazy, what? but as far as I know, Cloud was never in Nibelheim five years ago. Oh, this is when he was like passed out. Stream. It is the very essence of our star. It's the fucking dude. It's the fucking the guy. blood coursing through its planetary veins. According Every to Hojo, they're connected Hojo. to Sephiroth. Shadows of the Man, I believe he called them. Sephiroth was in Midgard. We fought him. Oh my god, everything's still the same. Whatever happened, he's alive. But why come back now? This is going to be the start of the game. It's going to be at the start. After five years, doing who knows what. Shit. The reunion. Well, now, I think we woke it up. Angered it more like. You can please the new! Yo, 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 yo! Feast your eyes on the Turks later. Oh, the Turks! Elena. She may be new, but she's still a Turk. This nigga again. I cannot wait. Oh my god. Holy shit! They say she's a monster, that she can peer inside you, into the very depths of your soul, that she can become those you hate, those you fear, those you love. Free, you, yeah. You murdered my dad. You burned my village. Do you know that I killed her? So, who is she? Rebirth, bro. <gasps> yes! Two discs. There you have it. That was Final Fantasy VII Rebirth coming early 2024 Best. to PlayStation 5. Holy Nomura son, thank you so much. Holy shit. All right. <laughs> That's gonna do it. Yo, is this gonna be out of all the games to end summer games? Shut your bitch ass up! Shut your bitch ass up! Nobody listening to you, dumbass bitch! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! You're irrelevant. Shut up! a hands-on event for media here in Los Angeles, including Cyberpunk 2077. So does that mean they're gonna finish? Like, wait, wait, wait! Bethesda showcase on Sunday. 
Right now, though, stay tuned for Day of the Devs hey, from iMakeup and yeah. Double Fine, which celebrates the independent game culture with a number of new game reveals over the next hour. We'll see you this summer, later this summer, on August 22nd for Gamescom opening night live in Germany and again in December when we come together here in Los Angeles to celebrate oh 10 years God, of the crazy. Game Awards. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you soon. W event. Whoa. W event. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Oh, I can't wait. <coughs> Excuse me. Damn, early 2024, wow. bro. Early 2024? Damn, man. Damn. That's fire. That's amazing. Holy shit. Well, chat. This shit start. This shit starts at uh seven. I think. Hold on, let me look. Oh my god, that's fire.